Today we are going to be installing the new Speedworks handlebar controls onto my 2017 Articat Mountain Cat. To start, you remove the hood and take off the factory handlebar controls. Now that we have all the stock handlebar parts off, we can start installing the new Speedworks kit. I have chosen to use a tether, which is highly recommended from Speedworks. <laughs> works and I would recommend it to it works really well and now I'm going to show you how easily the tether works everything still works like a factory Got your reverse over here, put my tether down here, and I put my handlebar switches down here, and then my highs and my lows right here. With this kit, it also comes with a new throttle block. I had to adjust my throttle to get it stiff and tight, but other than that, it went on great. This kit will stop you from accidentally bumping your kill switch or your handlebar arms when you're going on the trail or in the trees when you don't really need to kill your sled and you accidentally bump it. This kit, you have to hold the button to shut it off, which I like much better because it's not a simple click and your sled turns off. This kit, you have to physically hold it. It's not going to accidentally turn off. And then your handlebar arms are down here. You're never going to accidentally bump them when it's a cold day and they're going to turn them off. If you want them off, you're going to turn them off. They're not going to turn accidentally off. Due to the factory throttle block safety switch no longer being there, Speedworks highly recommends the tether, keeping you safe while you're riding your snowmobile. This kit drops 0.45 pounds from the stock handlebar setup and is $269.95 on Speedworks website. And I'm going to link that below. 